My name is Tony Woolley, and this is Click. So today I want to talk to you about piracy. I want to talk to you about the um, ideology behind piracy. Why does it exist? What's going on with piracy? What makes it so such a problem for game companies, music companies, modders? <laughs> um, and why does why does it? Why do people get so angry about it? It's been around since the beginning of time. Pirates come in and they take the booty and they run off with it, and then sell it to someone else, or they use it themselves. Um, when it comes to online uh, piracy, it, whether it's digital music, uh, whether, it's, whether it's movies, music, video games, modding, <clears throat> can be, can be pirated, and that's honestly. It, that sucks, you know. It sucks that if you're a creator and you're doing online stuff, you're creating, a, you know, you're creating a, a cool picture, you're creating an awesome album, music, you're creating a, an awesome video, you're making, um, but people end up pirating it. You know that that sucks. The, the the conversation today I want to have you about is, you know, let's talk about piracy as a whole, and not and and ask you why, you know, why to my own opinion wise, this is particularly my own opinion why piracy exists. Um, I feel that when piracy happens, I feel like it's because one, it's because there's a market where people can't get to your product, but they want to see it anyway. It's like I, the Game of Thrones piracy thing. That, like, that was huge because people want Game of Thrones. They want to see. They want to watch the show. They want to see what's happening. They want to see what's going on. And I, I feel like, um, and one of the reasons I'm bringing this topic up is because a buddy of mine was telling me, and I was having a conversation with, I was kind of having a conversation with another fellow modder, that. Their mod had been pirated, and I felt really bad because I understand they put hours and time and hard work, calculations, uh, file networking, programming into creating their mod, but it gets pirated because people want to put it on certain another platform that that person has said, "No, I don't want you to put it on that platform because you're gonna cause problems for my mod." And yo, I get that. I get that. I get that hugely. Like my brain goes. <laughs> You know, when I think about that, like, it's not a joke, it's, it's, it sucks. You put time into something, you want credit where credit's due, and you want people to kind of listen to you, but unfortunately there's a small group of people, no matter what you say or do, they're going to do what they're going to do anyway. The, the, the case on that is just try your best to try to convince them, if you can, to try to work with you. Now, when it comes to money, like, if I was to have my own business, that's it, no, 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 it's not money. If I, if, let's say I'm a business owner and I have products I'm selling to you that are digital, or there, there's whether it's a game, media, music, uh, paintings, pictures, comics, you know, stuff like that. Um, I want you to be able to experience my product. I want you to be able to see it. And if I find out you're, you're there's more pirates on my product than the money I, you're, you're willing to pay, there's some there's a reason behind that. Now, whether it's access, affordability, I want to know because sometimes. Sometimes pirates they'll pirate your stuff because they want to test your they want to test it to see if they like it, and if they like it they'll go out and buy it. They actually recommend to their friends. Yeah, you gotta you should go buy this. This is great. I've heard cases of that, but I've also heard cases of people just stealing shit because they can, and, and that sucks. You know it really does. It it it, it, it kind of gnaws at you in a way as a creator myself. It's like oh and I'm always afraid, but I also understand that piracy is going to be around forever. You can you can combat it as much as you want, but it's going to happen. People are going to pirate no matter what you do. So the case on that is try to find a balance where you can make your money and where you can't. If the piracy is too much, you have to ask the question, why? Why is there more pirating instead of buying my thing? Is it because it's affordability? Well, your piracy is, is cheap and free. Okay, yeah, but, you know, if you talk to your audience or, or the people or the, or the customers, you know, hey, why are you pirating my stuff? And nine times out of ten, they'll give you an answer. And you may not want to look at the answer, but there's an answer to your question. So it's funny how, you know, as we're going into the mod creation, the creation club, um, we're going behind, behind more paywalls of everything, how piracy is starting to really, I mean, don't get me wrong, piracy has always been, but I'm seeing, you're starting to see more of a rise of it uh, in a way. And I think the more rises you see, the more companies and people you're going to start seeing trying to fight them. But the problem is on a day of technology, there's always going to be pirates no matter what you do. The case is to, is to try to make your your case better to the customer than the pirates. And I, I honestly think that's the best, honestly, I could come up with on my opinion. 
What do you what do you think? What do you let me know in the comment section down below? What do you think of piracy? Do you think it's compatible? Do you think that piracy will be you know that we'll be able to get rid of piracy total, or do you think that maybe piracy is just something we're gonna have to deal with and just kind of find a, a nice balance in between the business aspects of things and the piracy world? Um, first of all, if you guys like my channel, I want to thank you. Um, uh, please go ahead and subscribe if you like if you if you, if you like if you like want to see more of my videos. Um, I try to upload a video every week. If I can, um, if you like this video, like it, share it, appreciate it, get the word out about Tony Wale, the really cool dude with a cool hat, cool shirt. I know you like this game. <laughs> I actually do own it. Yes, I do own the game. It's Xbox 360. Um, and uh, let's get people part of the conversation. You know, I want to know. Once again, my name is Tony Wale. Thank you for the click, and I'll see you next time.